Good morning and welcome back. We've both been absent a little bit because we've both been rather sick and well. So we haven't really been doing that much. We've still got some of that boundary to clear off. But it's time to foley spray, fertiliser. Um, should have done it to... We do it every 10 days and should have done it like two days ago, but the weatherman said it was going to rain, but he didn't, and he didn't yesterday. Anyway, today is absolutely glorious. We've got that light little mist hanging over the paddocks. So get the tractor out, get it warmed up, and uh, go get my cup of, first cup of coffee, then we'll get started. Okay, so I've got my coffee, the engine's warmed up, I've got um, my foliar fertiliser here in water, um, I have agitated it when I first mixed it, I'm going to do it again, make sure everything is dissolved, because uh, sometimes a couple of the larger crystals, if, um, if you don't agitate it enough, then they don't quite dissolve. This is basically just micronutrients with a little bit of uh, nitrogen to help carry it along into the leaves. That's all it is. So I'll give this a stir up and then we'll uh, get the agitator going on the tractor and get going. It's actually quite cool for this time of the year. It really does feel quite cool. Okay, let's go and get the PTO running. This is basically just a wetting agent. It helps the fertilizer to stick to the leaves and spread across the leaves. I suppose it works a bit like soap, you might say. There's a surface tension and helps it to stick to the leaves. So now it's just a matter of um, topping off the tank. This, you can, there's a little um, visual, a clear tube. Um, I replaced it a few months ago because the other one was becoming quite opaque and it was getting hard to see, certainly at night time, hard to see what the level is. So I'm just going to top this off. I sort of pre-fill it the day before. Yesterday I put uh, I think about 250 litres in ready just so that I'm not spending as much time this morning sitting around. So we'll get that done and then we'll get gone. Need to do it before the heat of the sun comes out because that can burn the leaves. So all done, tank filled, everything. I tend to foliar fertilise in the morning, early in the morning, because um, some of the fertilisers can be quite corrosive, so I like to rinse the tractor off afterwards, and then every month or so 
couple of months, I'll give it a, a soap wash. Um, just to stop it from burning into the metal and everything. And it's just easier to do it in the morning and daylight than finishing at 9, 10 o'clock at night and trying to rinse it off at, at night time. So, we get going now. I've had my coffee, so I feel more human. So, just rinse the lid off, just stop any um, bits going in there. Going to half fill the tub now with clean water. Start the um, PTO up and spray to clean out all these nozzles and everything with clean fresh water. And then also, again, I've got some water already in, ready for the next spray. And then rinse the tractor and everything off. Get the, hopefully, the worst of the um, fertiliser off it. Cut down on corrosion and rinse off all the bits of grass and everything off the tractor wheels. So that the shed doesn't get... Um, overly dirty so while that's filling where are we half seven um i'll go and get my second cup of coffee see if angela's up yet left her in bed have a nice lie in a happy wife means I'm not in trouble. Second cup of coffee. There's about 150 litres in the tank, so I'll just um, flush out all the pipes and everything with clean water, then rinse down the tractor and put it to bed. Okay, that's everything rinsed off. So this fertilizer is what we spray once the trees have got fruit on. Um, just helps with the filling out of the fruit and everything. Keeps the tree nice and healthy with all the macro and micronutrients because if the tree starts to struggle, then as you know, 
the leaves will start to turn yellowish etc which then means that they can't photosynthesize to fill out the fruit so that's that's what we're doing now all right thanks for joining us and um hopefully see you next week bye now